All right, hello everyone, uh, Rob here, and this video is going to be like a sister video to the how do you get Ecamm live audio into Zoom. Uh, this is going to be for the folks looking to clean up their audio, uh, making sure that any music that you play sort of gets heard uh, in a natural way. Um, because here, here's what's happening inside of Zoom without your, without you even thinking about this, right? So any kind of highs and lows uh, may get distorted. Um, you may hear dead spots when there's really music playing. And that's because Zoom is thinking that that's potentially background noise and it's trying to cancel it out for you. And what we want to do is inside Zoom, we want to tell Zoom that, hey, Anything that's coming through my mic, I need you to play as if it's live, unaltered kind of kind of process, right? So let's go ahead and show you how to do that. Now this video here, I am assuming that you already watched how do you get the audio from Ecamm Live into Zoom. All right, I'm already, I'm already going to assume that you watched that. I'm not going to explain that part again because this is how you're going to be able to give your audience nice, clean audio from Ecamm Live. All right, so inside Zoom. We're going to go up here to here, and uh, I'm going to go ahead and click on Preferences. The audio section is what we want to look for. Okay. Now, inside the microphone, I, again, I want everything controllable by me. All right. I don't want Zoom controlling any of this stuff. So I am with with my microphone here. I'm going to basically choose the mid range here. I want to make sure that automatically adjust microphone volume is unchecked. Okay, because maybe I'm a DJ and I'm playing some music, I want to be able to to adjust that. Okay. Uh, now the next thing here, again, this is something that really totally goes missed by uh, by a lot of people, and it's the advanced tab here. So we're going to click on the advanced button, and we're going to take a look at the following section. We definitely want to go ahead and say say this right here: show in meeting option to enable original sound. That's key. Okay. We also want to uh, have this part here disabled. Okay, so make sure you, you disable it. And same thing with the intermittent background noise, right? So we're going to go ahead and disable that as well. Now, uh, that's really all the settings that you need to do. Now, the next thing that I, I also want to show you is, well, where, where is that button at that we saw? Well, if we click on New Meeting, and I'll go ahead and uh, create this here, uh, you should see a button in the top left right here that says turn on original sound. So when you are playing your music, you definitely want to have that turned on. Okay, So that's what's going to allow your guests to hear uh, exactly what's coming out of Ecamm into uh, from Ecamm into Zoom into their speakers. Okay, So that's what I found out. Uh, you know, hopefully you guys followed along with this. If you like the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Hey, guys, thanks for watching.